What's up, guys? It's James JF Audio. Uh, welcome to the channel. Um, if you've been riding with me, thank you for that so much. If not, if this is your first time on the channel, um, welcome. I'm glad to have you here. I'm a producer engineer. I enjoy making music, mixing music, um, engineering for live events, all that good stuff. Uh, right now, what we have here is we have a track uh, that I'm going to show you guys. Um, just a real vibey R&B-ish trap style uh, track that I made. Um, pretty slow, pretty mellow. Uh, got some ele elements of lo-fi in there. So um, let's get into that. And you know, before we do, if you have not already um, seen the last two videos that I posted, uh, one for the track Tonic, which is going to be the first track of my beat tape dropping before the end of this year. And then the second video was a video, uh, music video for Converse. Very simple music video, but I think it went well with uh, with the track. So go ahead and check those two out. Um, and thank you for doing that. Let's go ahead and get into this beat here. So this beat is called Pick Up. Uh, so this morning, what I was doing, I was updating some of the software um, on my computer. And in doing that, I came across the uh, UVI workstation, which I have not honestly used in a long time. So after updating that, I kind of went through it and started playing with stuff. I found their mellow instrument, which um, I love this thing. It's amazing. I, I can't get enough of it. Um, and, I, and I came across this uh, piano patch. Uh, I set the pan to alternating and I also added the filter on it. This is an original. Really harsh, but you know, you throw the filter on. this nice just lovely velvety sound to it that, that I can't get enough of so um, kind of mess with it a little bit and that's the chord progression that I came up with on, on this instrument uh, go ahead and go to their site and grab mellow um, it's it's been a while since I've used it so I don't know if it's still up there as a product but definitely if you can go ahead and get it um, so that was the first instrument that I laid down. The second one was this flute. Um, uh, you know, when I opened up Mellow, I just had to keep going with the trend. So uh, this was also another instrument from the UVI workstation Mellow. Just real simple flute line for that. Um, let me go ahead and play those together, matter of fact, for you guys so you can go ahead and listen. just the, the space of it there is some EQing that I need to do on the keys uh, but but really I, I just love the vibe that it gives the sound that it gives so um, next up was arcade um, I love arcade can't get enough of it uh, my guys PJ and TJ put me on and have not turned back um, and of course one of their more famous lines is the, is the hooked line uh, of samples um, I have a low and a high vox of the same sample. They're just kind of, uh, they're kind of uh, playing off of each other. And both of those together here. So that was really nice. Um, then came the rhythm stuff, uh, bass, drums, uh, anything else. Uh, so first up was this loop from the decap drums and knot kit. I uh, love that kit. Can't get enough. Now to get that kind of filtered sound, well, first I, I kind of uh, squeezed it together made a double time and then I threw half time on it um, I could have just stretched it out to match the tempo exactly of the track but 
I feel like halftime just gives it a different, it's a different feel when you squeeze it together and throw a halftime on there. It, it skips some of the notes, um, less cutting for me to do. Um, and that, that definitely pays off a lot of times. You know, just out of curiosity, I wonder how this would sound at one and a half or 1.5. I don't know. I'm about to find out. It actually doesn't sound bad, but of course, uh, it wasn't half, so we'll stick with that. Um, next up was the kick snare or kick rim. S side snare, snap, that stuff there. Hard hitting drums, uh, kick, drums that knock. Uh, rim shot is from the, I always forget this, the smack pack roundhouse, um, or the, yeah, the smack pack roundhouse kick uh, drum kit. And then, Snap is producer's choice. Um, what is it? I always like to reference where I get my drums just because, you know, if you have good sounds, why not, why not tell them? Why not support them? Trapped in Love Bundle is where the snap came from. Then a few other pieces from the Lakey-inspired uh, Lakey Lightning Drum Kit, which I love that kit. It's amazing. And the bass also came from the decap Drums at Knock. That was basically it. That's basically the track. Um, I did some arranging for the some volume on the uh, the hats, um, some automation on the master, and that's about it. Um, there were some you know accentuating pieces from either the lightning kit or the uh, trapped in love. Just some just some transition symbols and stuff like that, um, and then the tag, and that's about it. But yeah, um, I was really digging this track and just put it together this morning i really like the vibe of it so um finished arranging it already uh did a little bit of mixing um there's still there's still more that needs to be done but uh here is the the semi-final product i uh, hope you guys enjoy it
Well, guys, that is the end of the track. Um, if you like the beat, go ahead and uh, like this video. Uh, comment on your favorite thing about it. Also, a uh, serious question. Comment. There were a few times when I'm trying to screen record, I'm using this thing called uh, uh, ASIO Link Pro. Um, if, you've, if you have experience with this, let me know uh, what I can do to keep it from overloading and resetting all the time because that tends to be a reoccurring issue. But um, if you have the solution for that, please let me know in the comments below. I'll be gr I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, go ahead and uh, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you can know when the next video goes up. Um, and yeah, yeah, I'll post this beat on my site if you want to grab it. And that'll be all set. Uh, thanks, guys, for joining me on this one. And y'all have a great one. Peace.